What's up guys, Justin here with another video. Welcome back to the channel. So we are into July of 2021 and I thought it would be a great time to update you guys with another video on how my games are performing revenue wise and, and uh, what they've been earning in the last six months. So first of all, these videos make me really uncomfortable. I'm not really one to talk about money, um, <clears throat> but at the same time, I really appreciate those uh, videos. When I was first starting out making games, I used to go into YouTube and search for indie game developer revenue numbers. And I really appreciated how transparent some of those developers were. And uh, yeah, I thought I would repay the, the favor and make a video of my own. So a little bit of a background story about me. I started making games around five years ago. I currently, I'm monetizing eight games on the App Store. I monetize through a company called Skills, and I've made quite a few videos um, about that whole process uh, before. So if you wanna check them out, feel free and uh, watch them after this video. So let's, uh, I won't keep you waiting. Let's dive into my computer and check the revenue numbers for the last six months. Okay, so I'm into my, I'm in my skills dashboard and I'm just going to change, go here and change to all games. And you will see for the last six months from January 1st until June 30th, I've earned a total of $102,405.94 with just under 200,000 installs. Okay, so I'm pretty happy with the way things are going this year, considering that at the end of last year, I made a total of $107,000. So we're already almost at that same level with another six months to go. So yeah, I, I'm really happy with the way things are going. Uh, I hope they continue to, to go up. Uh, let me just say one thing that the, this uh, growth is all from organic traffic, uh, meaning I haven't done any uh, paid user acquisition as of yet. It's still something I am learning day by day. I, I'm, it's, it's really hard for me because I'm not really an analytical type of person. So it's uh, a whole new set of challenges for me, um, dealing with up, DAO and cohorts and, and things like that. It really, it gives me a headache sometimes, but I'm I'm learning every day and taking courses. And um, yeah, that's the whole thing about uh, growing in any business. You, you constantly have to learn new things and evolve and adapt. So I guess I kind of want to make this video uh, maybe to give you guys some motivation. If you are just starting out, uh, it took me five years uh, just to get to these numbers. So don't beat yourself up if you're not there yet. Uh, just like I always say in my videos, consistency is key. Uh, because every time you upload a new game onto the App Store and you get that feedback, you learn so much. And if you keep applying what you learn to your future projects, uh, you will get uh, some momentum in no time at all. So yeah, just be patient. Don't beat yourself up. And um, even for myself, yeah, I, I feel really blessed. And I'm really happy with the numbers. At the same time, I still know that in my, for my own personal goals, um, where I would like to cross the seven figure mark and really grow uh, an in-house um, game studio team, uh, I know there's a lot of work to be done. So yeah, I'm under no illusions that uh, everything's uh, all milk and honey but um, yeah we all have our personal goals and just make sure you stick with yours and keep keep on learning that's uh, all that I can give you as advice so I hope you guys enjoyed this video um, if you did please leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this I kept this video nice and short for you guys so yeah I will see you on the next one and uh, take care. Peace.